Good evening and thank you for joining us on air and online. The holiday weekend saw thousands of people begin to get out and about Nashville. It's also the first full weekend of the eased phase restrictions as well. Let's go to News Force Joshua Cole. He's live downtown right now. Joshua, uh, what have the crowds been like today as we begin this holiday weekend? Hey there, Alan. Yeah, we've been out here most of this afternoon, and I got to say, it looks like it did almost back in March before we started going into the restrictions. Big, big crowds down here today, uh, but one big exception with those crowds. Most everyone was wearing a face mask in some way, but you know it wasn't only here. It wasn't only busy here on Broadway. Also at today's, the parks were crowded as well. People coming back into town, and uh, some people enjoyed a different kind of cold one. A little cup of ice, you know, yeah. makes somebody smile, somebody's day, it's worth it. Eddie's already sold out once today of his Italian ice. The lemon's probably the most popular. A nice day outside and eased COVID restrictions finally pulled people out to Centennial Park. Eddie, with mask and gloves on and cleaning supplies ready, he says he's missed seeing the locals and the tourists. We were hurting really bad out here. Just made the bus fit. I'll wear my mask. I gotta wear my mask. Farther downtown, Lower Broadway welcomed even more expanded sidewalks, police enforcing the mask mandate, and the lines. Actually, busier than what we thought. I didn't expect lines going into bars and whatever. Though people stood close to each other, there were masks, masks, and more masks being worn, in addition to the health department giving them away as well. From Broadway to the parks, some, like Eddie, says he sees it as everyone doing their part to get to stay open. Be nice to each other. Come have some mice. And if you look at the modified phase two plan, bars and restaurants are supposed to close at 1030 tonight. So uh, places down here on Broadway have about 30 more minutes before things will be starting to shut down. Alan? Yeah, traffic looks like it's back to normal almost. All right, thank you. 